How to use the XLOOKUP function here in Google Sheets to solve a real problem in a practical way. So let's say here in this spreadsheet I have informations such as the order date, the brand name, the cost, the product name, the salesperson, the customer name, the price and also the gross profit. In order to be able to calculate here the gross profit, I need to have a math that is price minus the cost. But as you guys can see, everything here in the cost are blank. So I need to fill in with the correct cost for each one of the products that I have. And I have a problem here because I, of course, can check each one of the costs of each one of the, the products in another sheet that is here, costs. And because I have each one of the costs associated with a product. But instead of manually check each one of the costs and each one of the products, I can use the XLOOKUP function to help me bring back as result this thing that I need, okay? That is the cost. So I can use the product name as my criteria to look up the product name and that way bring it back as result the value, the cost associated with the name of the product. And to do it, equal sign, the first thing that you need to do, and then X lookup function. Here we have just click one time to select the function. As the first argument, I have the third key. And the third key is going to be my product, that is this first right here. Just click here to, to the right. Or you can either click on the cell or open quotations mark and then type manually the name that you need. Okay. Open quotations and then type in the thing that you need and then close quotations, quote unquote. But here I'm gonna use the cell because I want to make it dynamic, comma. And now my lookup range is gonna be the range where I have the products. And the products are here in the cost in a different spreadsheet. So I can either select a small range like this, or I can click in the entire column, just click in the name here uh, over the letter to select the whole column, the entire column, and now comma. And my third argument here is the result range. And as I want to bring it back as result, the cost associated with the product name, now I need to select here the cost column. So let me click over the column E here, and that's it. Now I'm gonna press again, comma. And this last information that I need to input here is the word false because I want to bring it back as result, the exact match. So I need to input here the false word, close parentheses and then enter. Here we got the correct result, the value, the cost associated with the product name. Let me double click here in the down right corner of the cell to make sure all the rows now contain the same function, one, two, and yeah, we're done. Let's check if uh, it's correct. So let's take here, let's say, uh, it can be green tea, okay, green tea, 62 and 60 cents. Let me come back here to the costs and I want to check if the green tea has actually this value. So green tea, 62 and 60 cents. Yes, so it's perfectly correct. So this is how we can use the XLOOKUP function here in Google Sheets to help us to automate tasks, to bring it back as result, a value associated with our lookup thing. So I hope you guys, this video can help you out. And if you have any questions or any suggestions to the next videos, let me know, comment down below, and I see you tomorrow. As every day has a new video, I see you there.